Hey, what's up guys? Ryan Rig, the host of your show, Ryan Vlogs 2. Not the number two, not like you're going to watch this vlog, but T.O. like in addition, like also, what's up? It's Wednesday, it's shining bright, and I missed you yesterday on Tuesday, I'm sorry about that. I was preparing for today to go back to the future. Today's back to the future day. Today's the day Marty McFly went back to the future, October 21st, 2015. I tweeted some pictures of some uh, gear that Amazon had, um, some back to the future gear like the hat, the little vest Marty wore, the little headphones, a uh, little flux capacitor, USB charger, which I thought was the coolest little thing ever, like plugs into your cigarette lighter or your US, or your power outlet in your car and then it's got USB ports on the side to like charge your device. I thought it was the coolest thing ever and it had a flux capacitor that I would assume that lights up with LED lights. I don't know. I definitely want to get it. I shared it on social media. You should check it out. But yeah, if you saw it, today's like update day, I, I swear, for Apple. So I've got my Mac updating here, installing software update, about 18 minutes. That was uh, El Capitan 10.11.1 version. And then iOS 9.1 came out today on the iPhone. So updating that, uh, doing some bills, getting my desk organized and these other bills and things organized. You guys seem to enjoy the 1080p 60 uh, frame, the quality of the video the other day. So I'm gonna stick with that for a while until you guys tell me different. But you guys said you really enjoyed it. So I think it looked pretty well, or looked pretty good. It was pretty crispy, you know? And there's some exciting, uh, we were talking the other day, I'm waiting on uh, whatever that is from Rode Microphones, so can't wait to get that. But I also have something else exciting to talk about um, on no roughly on November 1st. So I'll have more information on that. It's a pretty big deal to me. I'm very excited about it. I've worked hard for it, so um, I can't really talk about it now. I know it sounds like, oh, well, that's not exciting if you can't tell us now. Well... I want to tell you I just can't and then I will in due time but here in a couple weeks I got a pretty cool big announcement I think so I'll be sharing that with you guys so if you're excited about that smash that thumbs up button on today's new vlog but it's Wednesday back to the future day I'm not going back to the future I'm here where I'm at now in the present um, but I thought about I was gonna uh, I need to wash my car it rained last night but I wanted to get it waxed and then do a clay bar which I don't know if you're familiar with detailing cars. Clay bar is just a way to remove contaminants off the paint that are kind of stuck to it. And you use a clay bar and you use some detail spray and you just kind of work a section and then wipe it off and kind of fold the clay up and then make it into a new little, you know, about the size of your palm and then work some more area of the car, spray some more like detail spray to keep it lubricated. Um, and then you'll have a really shiny surface and then you want to polish the vehicle to polish the paint and then wax it. Wax is the protection and still gives you shine. Polish is what brings the luster out of your paint. So you can just do a traditional wash and wax, you know, or you can just wash your vehicle and dry it. That's pretty good. Um, and then if you wax it, you're kind of waxing and sealing what's ever been bonded to the paint. You know, contaminants that you really can't see that don't come off with a car wash. So it's best kind of clay bar or use some type of like detailing wax. Um, so yeah, I use a lot of Meguiar's products. Pretty much that's all I use. Um, I've shared quite a few video or photos on Instagram and stuff. And I was gonna be working on a new car care series as well. Just kind of like how to prepare your vehicle for winter. Cause you know, winter's coming up. Uh, just some things, you know, that'll save you some steps and just kind of Try to help protect your car. Those that got a vehicle, you know, whether you're making payments or own it, doesn't matter, new or old, you know, your paint still deserves some protection. You can try to keep the car, whatever it may be, the, as shined up as you can. I mean, my first car was definitely not the best. It was a 1987 Ford Escort two-door hatchback. It was white, but I kept it as clean as I could because it was my first car. You know, I was excited about that. Um, you know, I didn't have it forever, but, you know, at age 16, you can't afford much, you know, so I was happy about uh, driving any car. It had a four-speed manual transmission, so I've been driving sticks since I learned how to drive, so almost, what, 20 years? Yeah, I'm old. <laughs> so the updates, we got to finish those on the Mac. Uh, like I said, paying bills today, just hanging out, wanted to talk to you guys for a little bit briefly. 
Um, I have $20 in reward zone at Best Buy. I thought about picking up the new, well, it's not new, but they re redid the game uh, for next gen console. Uh, the Back to the Future, the game, uh, it's been redone for next gen, so for the Xbox One. So I thought about playing that today and recording some gameplay for Gaming for Grandpa. Because it's like, how nostalgic would that be, you know, for Back to the Future? As you can see, I'm a huge Back to the Future fan. I've got right here the Back to the Future. This is the, uh, we'll pull it out here. This is the uh, 25th anniversary trilogy on Blu-ray. So it's all three movies digitally remastered in HD plus bonus features. This is my life. I mean, movies like that are my life. Like E.T., Weird Science, Wayne's World. Home Alone, Big, Men in Black 3, all of those excellent movies. Ah, the memories. The memories. What else was I going to tell you guys today as I look around here at my mess? I really can't wait to get all this cleaned up. Hopefully today. I really hope it'll be today. But it's always, it's, it's an area where I work, you know, so I can clean it up today and then tomorrow it'll be all kind of messed up again, you know, with like receipts and paperwork and it's just how it goes as a small business owner. You got to do it all yourself, you know? Everybody's like, your desk? I know, it's like not even a desk anymore, it's just like a place where I put all my stuff. So is this area of the kitchen table. So, exciting. I don't know if anybody's going to be down in the St. Louis area. Uh, Karen and I were talking about she wanted to do something fun and she had talked about um, You know, she's gonna wear the team her team fell sweatshirt fast electronic loud sweatshirt And we were like well if anybody's in st. Louis area and happens to go to fright fest on Saturday and Finds me or finds Karen there at Six Flags in st. Louis Then I'll give you guys like a free team fell wristband and we'll put you in the vlog So it's something fun. I know not a lot of people are down there and nobody will even be there but if the you know Random chance that you were down at Six Flags this Saturday for Fright Fest in St. Louis and you found me I'll give you a free team fell wristband. We'll talk. We'll put you in a vlog just to hang out and say what's up I thought that was cool something Karen put together because we have quite a few people that are you know kind of close to here You know, I live in Springfield, Illinois, but you know Six Flags is a popular place um, I'm not that popular of a guy I was just saying if the what if happened. I thought it would be cool She brought she brought the idea up. So I thought it was awesome for her and I keep uh, Checking the mail and waiting for UPS not sure when I would expect said package from um, Road microphones, but it probably wouldn't be long because they don't they don't take too long to ship I need to clean that window. I always clean the outside of it and then it's just so dusty from the fields and mowing and dirt on the highway from construction so the inside's clean but it looks dirty but i'm gonna go ahead and wipe that with windex again because i'm just a ocd clean freak i like glass and mirrors and everything clean and cars shiny and dishes done i gotta put a load of laundry in the dryer holy cow yeah not a whole lot going on for the wednesday i don't know if we'll do anything else today I always try to tell you guys I want to have a short vlog and then today's are like the boring ones I always talk about well not a lot going on but I still made one and talked to you um, but I want to give you something exciting and then I always say it'll be short and then it ends up being long like a TV movie or TV mini series where you need like to take off work for months at a time to watch it I know I know I'm just a uh, I talk a lot but you guys watch it so um, I'm gonna go put this load of laundry in the dryer that's what I need to do as you can see, it's definitely laundry day. The gaming setup. That setup, though. I need a setup like that. But, oh, what a cool shirt. Hey, that's a pretty cool t-shirt right there. Ha <laughs> ha. Must have had some loose change in my pocket. Check it out. 57 cents in the washer. We call that balling on a budget right there. I'll take that.
says it's 79 degrees outside today. That's incredible. Absolutely incredible for the 21st of October here in central Illinois. I need to run a couple errands. Go deposit this little money here real quick. Got to pay a bill today. The convenience of depositing cash check at your ATM. Absolutely. And grab your receipt. And away you go. mail always such a bunch of waste it seems like I mean I know people read this some of it but it's like this huge advertiser that comes every single week but it's I mean I know it's made out of recycled paper but still it's an ads and everything else it's a digital world now plus a waste of trees definitely leave that open it's nice 81 degrees out right now it's like weird looking the screen just got done watering the lawn big lawn you know and the big plant mr. Jack Hopefully you guys had a good Wednesday. Not too much going on today, but hey, we still had a vlog. We still talk. We still hang out. That's what we do. And we stay smiling. But I'm Ryan Rigg, guys. The host of your show, Ryan Vlogs 2. Not the number two. Not like you're going to order yourself a flux capacitor from Amazon. Because you should. But T.O. like in addition. Like also. If you enjoyed today's vlog, please click thumbs up button. Subscribe if you're not. Remember the meetup Six Flags St. Louis this Saturday. Find me and we'll meet up. That's how we'll leave it at that. And then uh, don't forget we're giving away a GoPro camera at 30,000 subscribers on this channel. So hopefully you guys have a good hump day. Enjoy your Back to the Future day. I'm going to catch up and do finish some more work, get this edited, then probably watch one of the Back to the Future movies just for fun and or play the Back to the Future game on Xbox One. But like I said, if you enjoyed it, please click thumbs up, subscribe if you're not, and we'll see you guys. Thanks for watching.